Hello everyone, today I'll give you the full experience of flying with me on Nigeria's newest airline, Exijet. I'll be flying from Abuja to Lagos and I'm going to show you everything they have to offer. Exijet is the newest commercial airline in Nigeria actually, so I flew with them and then I'm going to tell you my honest verdict, alright? I'm sure most of you have never heard of it. So this time I'll skip straight to check-in, then to boarding and to the aircraft, which is what I'm most interested in seeing. This is how the, the patrol area is like in the morning. My flight was a 7 a.m. flight out of Abuja. As you can see, some airlines counter hadn't opened. While some have started checking in passengers, just like my airline. So I checked in online, I just picked my boarding pass and then I went on to board. If you have seen my video on Value Jet from Abuja to Lagos, you would have noticed that the terminal seemed familiar because I'm flying through the same terminal once again, which is Terminal B. And you can see our plane at the tarmac is already there, so the flight was on time. Actually, I've seen two aircraft. Let me tell you something about these two aircraft. One is a CRJ 200, and it is all business class flight for exigents. And the other one is the Embraer E190. The flight time for both of them are the same, so they are supposed to leave by seven, seven o'clock, seven o'clock. All right. So that's why you see them back side by side. Boarding, however, was a bit chaotic and then not very organized. Before the first boarding announcement was made, they had already started boarding us. So why I was now going to board that, they now made the first boarding announcement. Here is our aircraft. It is painted all white with an Exiget livery. Registered as UR EMA. This is Exiget's 13 year old Embraer E190 jet. Wet leased from Ukraine's Windrush Airlines. The cabin has a 2 2 configuration and the overhead bins are very large. Large enough that they can accommodate all kinds of carry on. Plus, Exiget offers free checked baggage along with carry ons, which is a very nice touch. After boarding, I found out that the plane was about 30% full and we had a roll of seats behind me at the back. So I sought approval for a seat change from the cabin crew if I could move to the back and then I received approval for the switch. In the seat back pocket, you'll find a Windrush airline safety card written in Ukrainian language and also in English language. You'll also have an A sickness bag as well. But inside of the back pocket, it's a little bit dirty. The leg rooms are very okay, very, very comfortable. Unfortunately, there are no power plug or USB ports, which might be a downside for some passengers, but otherwise, it was perfectly okay. It depends if you need power plug, although most devices should have batteries that last 55 to 60 minutes. Yes, I didn't know initially that the aircraft was wet list, so it came with a foreign crew from Ukraine. So the guys here are Ukrainian. I had opportunity of speaking to one of them. We talked about Ukraine, talked about the war, talked about Nigeria, and then you know stuff like that. You're from where? We are from Ukraine. Ukrainian aircraft, uh, Ukrainian crew. We will stay in Nigeria only one month, and uh, then, then we will return to home to Ukraine. So the aircraft is going to go back to Ukraine after uh, one month. Maybe in Ukraine uh, not return because we have war, but. Uh, Sometimes aircraft stay in Europe, sometimes uh, fly to other countries and operate with other co other uh, companies mm. like Nigeria. That's nice. What is your name? My name is uh, Sri. All right. And what is your name? My name is Adachi. 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 Same here. For how long have you been here? Uh, 
now we stay two weeks and uh, we will stay during uh, one month. The war in Ukraine, how does it affect you, uh, your family? Hope everybody is okay. Every day we have attack, uh, every day we have rocket attack, uh, hundreds of rockets every day. Now uh, my family is safe and we hope uh, for our victory as soon as possible. It will be well. Thank you. Thank you. Provide your boarding passes. We need to cross check. We have the correct number on board. Thank you. Good morning, ladies and gentlemen. Welcome aboard FCJet. For your safety and comfort, please store your hand luggage in the overhead compartment or under the seat in front of you. The crew went through the safety demonstration and all other announcements, and everything was done in English. The flight was about 20 minutes behind schedule and the plane was only 30% full. Shortly after takeoff, we were handed a pack and a bottle of water. Inside the pack, we had a muffin, juice, biscuit, and a mint. Now that we have gained some altitude, let's continue with our tour. One of my favorite features in reviewing airline is the individual overhead events. And this one works fine. Everything is in perfect condition. The recline function button works fine. It's perfect with a movable armrest in the middle. But I wouldn't recommend reclining your seat because it could be uncomfortable for the person sitting right behind you. The cabin is very, very clean and well maintained. The interior still reflects Windrose Airlines design. The seats are grey leather with Exiget Airlines signature red and white headrest, which looked nice. While the flight is marketed and sold through Exiget, everything else is done by Windrose Airlines. So I'll explain what's happening here. Being an Exiget ticket, Windrose is a separate airline. This arrangement is called a wet lease, which is where the Windrose airline provides essentially everything, including the aircraft, the crew, maintenance and insurance for the aircraft. And XJet just pays them for a final product, and it is called ACMI.
time for left hold. The lavatory space is small, but every other thing was super clean and smells fresh with all the usual essentials you'd come to expect. Finally, we have landed at Moritala Mohammed Airport 2, that is MM2. And I'm going to give you my final thoughts. What do I think about Exigets and their Embraer E190 service? While the flight was smooth, the cabin crew service had its highs and lows, being that the plane and crew were not technically entirely Nigerians. I don't know how much credit we can give the Nigerian crew here. The Windrush Airlines crew were fantastic, attentive, friendly and proactive. They came through the cabin multiple times to ensure passengers were comfortable. However, their Nigerian counterparts were uninterested in passengers, that is the exigent crew themselves. They acted bored, hardly smiled, nor made any eye contact. It would have been nice if the crew were more friendly. And then I also noticed the disembarkation process. It wasn't organized. Immediately the plane landed, people just got up you know, from the back, they started pulling their luggage. I'd wished it were more organized or passengers were told what to do or maybe to disembark from front to back or back to front, whichever one they preferred, but that's okay. Aside from this downside, the flight was largely uneventful, which I don't have any qualms with. It was a nice flight. Thank you, my God. The Bye. best passenger. Thank you. <laughs> Thank you so much for joining me. I hope you enjoyed this review. Am I recommending the airline 100%? And will I fly them again? Definitely. And I'm actually looking forward to flying their all business class as well. And how much did this cost me actually? So I don't know if they're going to change for tomorrow. But for now, it's a flat 90k. So with 90k, you can actually fly to Lagos, Abuja and Abuja, Lagos. And they only operate two flights. I mean, not to fly. They have two destinations for now. Lagos, Abuja, and Abuja, Lagos. That's what they do for now. Maybe by tomorrow, they might increase their destination. And I'm looking forward to seeing them increasing their destination. And I'm also looking forward to flying them again. And I wish, I wish Exigets the best. And I pray that you succeed and break even. Thank you so much. I'll see you on my flight next time. Bye-bye.